T-Mobile is expanding T-Satellite, its partnership with Starlink to provide basic connectivity where cell towers can't. More apps are now supported from Android and iOS. We'll have details after the break. Hi, I'm Andy with the Mobile Internet Resource Center, and today we're going to talk about T-Mobile's T-Satellite service. Now, this service is a partnership between T-Mobile and Starlink, and essentially what it allows you to do is communicate directly to Starlink satellites with your compatible smartphone. Now, this is intended to be a gap-filling service, so it's only going to be used if you're in an area that doesn't have any cell service at all. And you also need to be outside and have a clear view of the sky so that your compatible smartphone can see the uh, Starlink satellites. It is also a low bandwidth service, so it's not like getting high-speed broadband uh, Starlink, nor is it as fast as a regular cellular connection. But it is improving and it is getting faster. And just last week, T-Mobile announced a bunch of new apps that are now compatible with the T-Satellite service. So this means that when you're in an area with no cell signal and you are on T-Satellite, that the data used by these apps will go over the satellite connection. Now there's a lot of great apps on the list, which is uh, uh, here up on the screen. And it's also in our uh, article which is linked in the description below and includes apps for both Android and iOS. Now one of the big uh, features is the capability with WhatsApp which is a very popular uh, messaging app uh, that's used around the world and with WhatsApp it is allowing you to use voice and video calls over a T satellite connection which is uh, a really fantastic capability to have. So now we do expect the list of satellite compatible apps to continue to grow and once uh, Starlink can get more satellites in orbit that support this particular uh, functionality, the capabilities of T-Satellite service will grow. Now T-Satellite is available uh, and is included on T-Mobile's top tier consumer and business smartphone plans on other T-Mobile plans that don't include it for free. Uh, you can get it as an add-on for uh, usually $10 a month extra. Now, if you're not a T-Mobile customer, you can still get T-Satellite service, but you do need to have a compatible smartphone that has eSIM and it operates basically like having a second data line on your smartphone via eSIM. So details of that are in our linked article, which uh, link to the uh, relevant T-Mobile pages for more information. So it's great to see this uh, satellite connectivity expand and to have a lot of these useful and valuable apps now be able to be used when you are really off grid and not in range of any cell towers. So stay tuned for more updates. I'm sure that T Satellite will continue to grow in the future. But for now, that's all we have for you today. We appreciate you watching. Stay connected, and we'll see you next time. These videos are brought to you by our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.